Ms. Miller, you're recognized for five minutes. Thank you, uh, Chairwoman Fox, and thank you, Congresswoman Steele, for leading this important legislation. Uh, first of all, to my colleague on the left, he said he understood the intent of this legislation. Well, this, you are actually misunderstand or misrepresenting the intent. This is not about students. This is about money coming from uh, nations that are a national security threat to us. This bill establishes a zero tolerance policy toward nations that pose a national security threat, such as China and Iran. It requires full transparency if these adversarial nations contribute even a single dollar to any of our colleges or universities. During 2018 and 2019, Joe Biden's Penn Biden, Universe, Penn Biden Center at the University of Pennsylvania received more than a half a million dollars from a group with ties to the Communist Party of China. The House Oversight Committee also discovered that the University of Pennsylvania paid Joe Biden $900,000 during this very same period. A new report yesterday by Barry Weiss also highlights that at least 200 American colleges and universities withheld information on $13 billion from foreign regimes with much of that coming from the Middle East. Pro-Hamas groups have gained a foothold in our colleges, very sadly. And the colleges and universities raking in money from the Middle East appear to be ignoring Title VI while they allow Jewish students to be threatened and harassed on campus. H.R. 5933 holds taxpayer-funded colleges and universities accountable. It requires public disclosure of foreign gifts to individual staff and reveals foreign investments and endowments. We must protect students, universities, and our American values by eliminating foreign influence on college campuses. Again, I want to thank Congresswoman Steele and Chairwoman Fox, and I yield back. The gentlewoman yields back. Mrs. Hayes, you're recognized for five minutes. So are we even surprised that Joe Biden's organization was receiving hundreds of thousands of dollars from China and the CCP? Uh, at this point, absolutely not, right? We've seen what he's been involved with, what Hunter has been involved with, Hunter Biden, his son, and these guys are sketchy, as sketchy as it gets. Um, I'm glad it's finally coming to light here. We need Republicans and re Democrats too to be uh, to expose this stuff and be honest about how corrupt the Biden family truly is. Um, he's president of the United States. He, it, this we need transparency on this. We need this to be torn into. And we need some answers. Where are you receiving nearly a million dollars from? Uh, from? Well, first from the University of Pennsylvania, but that money came from CCP organizations and, and uh, places connected with China, which is one of America's adversaries, one of our biggest rivals. They're trying to undermine us at every turn. This is very disturbing. Every American should be disturbed by this. Um, so, and, and we need to keep digging into it. We, this, this can't stop here. We need to know what the Biden family is truly involved with. Uh, so anyway, let me know what you guys thought of this clip in the comments and thank you for watching.